Hi, my name is Stephanie Guzman, and I'm an optical engineer at Edmund Optics. Today I'd like to answer the question, why should I choose a lens specifically designed for sphere wavelengths? Well, it all comes down to your application. If you're trying to see through something that's opaque to visible light, you might need to use infrared light. A common example would be food inspection. Although the skin of an apple is opaque in visible light, it's actually transparent in the IR. So you're able to use shortwave infrared light to see the bruises on an apple without damaging the apple itself. Another example would be to see through certain types of plastic. Maybe you're trying to detect defects in a product that has a plastic casing. Well, you could be able to see through the plastic casing without cutting it open using infrared light. Another example is surveillance. Although smoke is very opaque to visible light, it's transparent in the infrared. Something else to consider is aberrations. If you determine that you need to use infrared light for your application, you wouldn't just be able to use any lens on the market. Lenses that are designed for visible light will take visible wavelengths into consideration and not infrared wavelengths. One example is chromatic aberration. Visible lenses are designed so that a red, a green, and a blue wavelength in the visible are all compensated for each other. Whereas once you move into the infrared, they might not be anymore. So you would need a lens that was specifically designed to handle the infrared wavelengths. Another thing to consider is the transmission of the lenses. Visible lenses are made with materials that transmit visible light. They oftentimes start to absorb in the IR. So you would need a lens that is using materials that are specifically designed for your wave band. Another thing is the coatings on the elements. In a lens designed for sphere wavelengths, the elements will have coatings that are specifically designed not to reflect in the IR. This will allow you to have greater transmission, and so when you're seeing something faint, like something through smoke, you'll be able to collect all the light that you need. If you need more resources, please check out the Edmund Optics website, or you can chat with one of our product support engineers at any time. Thank you.